if you just look at raw data, um, the least happy group is 14 to 28. So yes, so college students are right smack in the middle of the least happy group, sort of in terms of age. Um, I have two kids in college right now, one is a freshman and one is a junior, so I'm well aware of sort of how hard it is to be a college student and that just that age where you're trying to find your identity and your relationships and you just sort of, yeah, it's, there's a lot of uncertainty in life and there's a lot of mental health issues that we see, of course, in college, those ages. So yeah, 14 to 28 is the least happy group. And basically happiness, the good news is it increases over time. We become, Laura Carson at Stanford has a theory that basically shows that people become emotionally wiser as they get happier as they age. So the, depending on the study, the high point in happiness might be at 65, 67, 72. Um, you know, I haven't seen sort of any recent data on it, but I'm sure there's, you know, lots of data. Um, that be, and then, and there's, they're basically showing that people get happier as they get older when you're very old happiness starts to decrease.